On this video, I'm going to carry on the three-way conversation between Zalman in 2015, Jessica in 2017, and Jessica today in 2019. The three-way conversation between the three people, which have already started this conversation on Tuesday last week. Please accept my apologies. My regular camera is not working, so I'm using a different camera today. As a result, there will not be any pauses in between different characters coming up. So please accept my apologies. I'm going now to get Zalman. And whilst I go and get Zalman, I will play for you some lovely music. Alexa, please play some songs by the Miami Boys Choir. Shuffling songs by the Miami Boys Choir on Amazon Music. Alexa, stop. I don't know what to do. I really know what to do. Yes, things are getting quite difficult. And the situation is really, really troubling. I've had another suicide attempt just a couple of days ago. I don't know what to do. I know that Jessica in 2017 and 2019 goes along the path of saying that life is so much better. I can't, I can't, I know I'm going to get death threats. I know, I'm, I just can't do this. Why are they judging me? Why are they judging me? Do they have any idea what I'm having to grapple with? Do they have any idea what struggles I'm having to put up with? I'm juggling here a very difficult situation and I'm taking full responsibility for what I have to take responsibility for. I need to be the responsible person here. I can't just walk away. How am I expected to walk away? <laughs> I don't know what to do. I do want to get to a place where I'm strongly validated from within. And Jessica in 2019 told me how amazing she feels. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do. I'm totally, I'm totally stuck for an answer. I'm totally stuck for an answer. Yes, I know that Jessica in 2019 and Jessica in 2017 are both telling me how they feel so validated from within and, and they feel so good to have their own independence. But I can't. I, I just can't do it. I really don't know what to do. I, I want to be able to survive. I want to be able to be the responsible one in this, in this situation. I don't want to just walk off and transition. And then what? Alexa, play songs by Miami Boys Choir. Alexa, play songs by Miami Boys Choir. Shuffling songs by the Miami Boys Choir on Amazon Music.
Alexa, stop. I, I don't understand. What am I supposed to say? What am I supposed to say? You, you, you're dealing with a situation where you're not authentic. You, you, you just had a suicide attempt, right? You just had a suicide attempt. By the way, I'm Jessica from 2017. That's what I would introduce myself. You just had a suicide attempt, Zalman. Come on. Who, who are you surviving for? Who are you surviving for? You're surviving for a, for a non-reality? Non, you're not even existing? Seriously. You really, really have to take charge of the situation. I don't get it. I don't agree with it. I'm really, really sorry, but I don't agree with it. What do you think, Jessica in 2019? I'm going to go and get Jessica in 2019. Alexa, play songs by Mordechai Ben David. I can't find songs by What Happened David. Alexa, play classical music. Okay, here's a station for you. All classical on Amazon Music. Alexa, stop. Well, 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 uh, all I have to say to you, Zalman, is um, you know the answer yourself. You're picking on the answer yourself. You want to give yourself the best chance, right? You're not going to give yourself the best chance if you're going to end up suicidal and you're going to end up dead, right? 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 Doesn't take much of a brainer. But Jessica in 2017, please. Please bear in mind that this is quite a difficulty. Let, let's face it. Let, let's be really, really honest about the situation here. It's quite a difficult situation. And even you in 2017 did not know that you're going to get to 2019 and get to an amazing, amazing place. What's so amazing about 2019? Well, in 2019, you validate yourself from within. And anybody who was manipulative was thrown out of Jessica's life. So even 2017, whilst you were in a good place, nowhere near as good as the place is now. Comparably, you were in a very bad place, actually. You were dependent on others. You were reliant upon very manipulative people. I'll never forget that time you went to visit one of these friends and you had to wait outside for five hours because the person couldn't be bothered coming because it was you were important to the person and as a result of that wait i remember you felt very distraught and you were crying so please please just realize that in 2017 you're not there yet far from it and even 2019 you're not fully there yet either but you're getting to a better place you're getting stronger and as tony robbins says on the other side of rejection is success so between the two of you, I really expect a better understanding of the situation. Now I'm going to go and get Zalman. He's going to come back and give his response. Alexa, play classical music. Okay, here's a station for you. All classical on Amazon Music. <laughs>
I'm really sorry, but I don't think that you both begin to understand what I what it is I'm grappling with. What it is I'm grappling with. Yeah. You know, I take responsibility. I'm a mature person. I'm a caring person. And I take responsibility for the people in my life. If I go off to transition, I will effectively be doing an irresponsible thing because I will not be taking proper responsibility for the people in my life. Alexa, please stop. I will not be, hence, taking full responsibility for the people in my life, caring for them, and um, it's it just, there's just no other way to do it. I have no other way to do this. I'm devout, I'm holy, I'm really, ugh, I don't know what to say. I understand both of you are coming with good perspectives, good points, good good ideas, and, and you really have a good a good analysis on the situation and a good means of calibrating the situation. I agree, but you're not reverberating from where I'm reverberating from. You really cannot, you really cannot figure out what it is I'm struggling with, what it is I'm grappling with. Every single day, I'm grappling with this because I have a responsibility for the people in my life. You guys don't have responsibility for the people in your life. I'm really sorry, but you don't have responsibility for the people in your life, but I do. The thing is, I am suicidal, but still, I have responsibility for the people in my life. I am the responsible, only one that's responsible around here. Um, Jessica 2019 is coming back. Alexa, play songs from the Miami Boys Choir. Shuffling songs by the Miami Boys Choir on Amazon Music. Alexa, stop. Well, between you, Jessica, in 2017, and you, Zalman, in 2019. Sorry, what did I just say? Zalman 2019? No, there's no Zalmans in 2019. Between you, Jessica, in 2017, and you, Zalman, in 2015, I want to just tell you one thing. It is very, very, very important, very, very important and of absolute vitality that you are grounded from within, that you don't live for others. We didn't come into this world to live as a facade for others. We didn't come into this world to serve others. We didn't come into this world to be a mask for others. When I say be a mask for others, because very often people use us as their mask. I will explain that one day, but take that at my word today. We didn't come into this world, we didn't come into this world to reflect other people's needs. We came into this world to be amongst people, to care for the people in our lives, to be independent, to be strong, and not be a people's pleaser. I'm really sorry, Zalman, but looking at your life back in 2015, all you did most of your life was please the people around you. And the people in your life were pleasing the people around them. Your entire life reflected and surrounded and circulated and really, really, really went around and around that concept of serving others. Serving. There was no such thing as a self. Nobody had self. Today in 2019, you take care of yourself. You're grounded, you're strong, you're validated from within, you're independent, and nobody violates your boundaries. If they do, they get shown the door. No second chances. The door. You don't violate Jessica Madden's boundaries in 2019. That is the most strongest spiritual 
elevation you could arrive at. Totally, totally, totally validating yourself from within. And not relying on others to give you what they can't give you. Nobody can give you validation. It has to come from within. And if somebody violates your boundaries, you get rid of them. No second chances. Goodbye. People who violate your boundaries, yeah, sometimes a person's having a bad day and it's understandable. You could discern that. It's not a big deal to discern why a person is upset and doing things which upset you. It's not a hard thing to discern. So that's understandable. But people who violate your boundaries because they know they get away with it, they need to be shown the door. No second chances. Jessica in 2017, Zalman in 2015, you are both going along that line of living for others, allowing others to manipulate you. I mean, Jessica in 2017, do you remember that story when you waited outside somebody's house for four hours because they knew they could manipulate and control you and they didn't care about how you felt as a result? For goodness sake, you know that this is the best approach and that is basically to validate yourself from within, to be independent. It's the best spiritual way to live life. It is the best Jewish way to live life, to live life if you're Jewish, Christian, Muslim, whatever your faith may be, or if you're not, if you don't have a faith, that's also fine. Whatever your faith or lack thereof, whatever it is, the way to live life is to live for yourself from within. No religion should ever be and there is no such thing as a religion. There is no such thing as a religion which tells people not to believe in their own independence. You have to be independent in order to make decisions. You have to be independent in order to make decisions about your religion. You have to make you have to be independent in order to have faith. Life is all about faith. I've spoken about this so many times. Life is all about faith. Whether you're religious, you have faith. Whether you're not religious, you still have faith. When you're secular, you have faith in the government. You have faith in an education system, which is not entirely foul proof. You have faith in you're gonna have you have faith that you're gonna have food to put on your table tomorrow, and you have faith that you could buy a car and you could hence have the money to pay for the car. You're always living with faith. Wherever you live in, whatever lifestyle you live in, it's about faith. And in order to have faith, you have to be grounded from within. Why? Because if you're not grounded within and you're living for somebody else, then you can't have faith. You can't be you. That's the end of the story. That's the end of the three-way conversation between Jessica, 2015, Zalman, sorry, I got that wrong. Zalman, 2015, Jessica, 2017, and Jessica, 2019. If you have any thoughts or comments, please leave your thoughts and comments or comments in the comment section down below. And if you are the 100 subscriber, remember, I'm giving away a free gift to the 100 subscriber. Just press that subscribe button and manifest your wish and be the 100 subscriber and receive that free gift. I'm Jessica Madden. I put out amazing videos here on YouTube and I help people raise their awareness and become very, very successful. I share great ideas. I love you all. I'm sending you high vibes and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. I love you.